Officer, how you doing, bud? Listen, what is that thing right there? That's a directional radar. So if you're driving, can you see how fast people are going in front of you? Yes. If they're driving towards you, can you see how fast? Yes. If they're driving away from you, can you see how fast? Yes. Do you have one in the back as well? Yes. Can you tell how fast people are driving when they're behind you? Yes. Thank you, officer. You're welcome. Drive safe. Hey, officer. Hey, I saw you just give a guy a ticket. What for? Failing to stop for school bus. How much is that? It's $490, six to merit points. You know what? Good. Drives me crazy. People not stopping for school buses. School's back. Does it affect your insurance? 100%. Good. Should be more in my opinion. Thanks, officer. Stop and watch for school buses. You got it. Hey, officer. Listen, cell phone tickets. What's the three most common excuses people give? Maps. I dropped it and just checking the time. So dropped it. They're picking it up. That's what they say. What about the maps? Maps. They're using it for GPS. And then checking time? Which okay. is already on their car. All right. Thanks, officer. You're welcome. Take care. Yeah. Hey, officer! Oh, come on! Listen, I got a bone to pick with you. I just got a cell phone ticket. Thing is, I was stopped at an intersection. Wasn't even driving. What do you got to say about that? Can't hold and use a cell phone. It was a red light. I wasn't even driving. Can't hold and use a cell phone operating a vehicle. You know this. All right, officer. Take care. Hey, officer! <laughs> hey, what's the last ticket you wrote? I just gave a rider a ticket for not wearing a helmet on an e-bike. Helmet on an e-bike? Right. You have to wear a helmet when you ride one of those electric e-bikes? Yes, you do. How much was that fine? $110. $110? Any points? No points. Thank you. You're welcome. Hey, officer, you got a guy pulled over. What do you do? Writing a ticket for obstruct plate. What do you mean, obstruct plate? He has a tinted uh, plate cover that obstructs the... Well, listen, I, I have a tinted plate cover, but you know what? When you're close to it, you can still see the numbers. The plate has to be plainly visible. Number one. And number two is technically you're not allowed to put any attachment onto your plate cover. How much is a fine? It's $110. Any points? No points. Thanks, officer. You're welcome. Officer. Hey, listen, do you guys record all your vehicle stops? Yes, we do. What's that right there? It's a body-worn camera. All Toronto police officers are equipped with one. Audio and visual records? Yes. Don't you have a camera inside the car too? Yes. What does that record? That captures anything that can happen in front of the motor vehicle. Conversations too? Yes. Thanks, officer. You're welcome. Be safe. You too. Officer, what's the three most common tickets you give out in the city of Toronto? Uh, number one would be distracted driving, speeding number two, and red lights number three. Thanks, bud. You're welcome. Have a good day. Drive safe. This guy, man. <laughs> you won't believe who I stopped again. The reason why I stopped is you have a tinted windshield and you have tinted plate covers. The tinted windshield, I bought it like that. The plate covers, the dealer put those on, I didn't put them on. Unfortunately, my friend, the onus is on the driver. Okay, hold on a second. I own the vehicle. I didn't tint the windshield, but I can still get the ticket? Yes. When you purchase a motor vehicle, you gotta make sure it fits under the criteria of the Highway Traffic Act. It's not even my vehicle. I still get a ticket? Unfortunately, the onus is on the driver of the motor vehicle. Give me something, I'll take it to court. Hey, officer. Uh, hey, listen, the upper part of my seatbelt, can I wear it under my arm, behind you're me? You're required by law to wear a complete seatbelt somewhere. Yeah, but it wrinkles my shirt, it wrinkles my suit. The upper strap keeps you from moving forward. The bottom strap keeps you in your seat. Uh, it doesn't seem fair. How much is the fine for this, anyway? It's $240, two demerit points. All right, thanks, officer. Have a good day. Click it, don't get a ticket. Drive safe. Hey, officer. Hey, listen, all you do is talk about traffic safety and enforcement and how much tickets cost. So let's say I just don't pay the tickets. What's the worst that could happen? If you don't pay your fines, your license will be suspended for unpaid fines. Okay, fine. My license gets suspended. I'm still going to drive around. So what happens if I get caught? On the first offense, it's $1,000 and it could include imprisonment. <laughs> all right, officer. Any advice for drivers? Make sure you pay your fines. Got it. Be safe. Hey, officer, what is it now? Hello, sir. The reason why I stopped you is you failed to make a complete stop at the stop sign. I slowed down, okay? The same thing that everybody else does. I didn't put my car in park. There's no rolling stop, sir. You either stopped or you didn't. Rolling stop. There was nobody else around, and it was safe when I went. You must make a complete stop at the stop sign or stop line Gee. under the Highway Traffic Act. How much is this ticket going to cost me? Anyways? How many points? It's three Demera points, $110 fine. Can you give me a break, officer? Make complete stops. 